What have what have your roles been and your duties been so far? Uh, pretty much to shadow Coach Taylor and Coach Koshery and, and learn a lot and wherever they need me, kind of fill in wherever I'm needed. You won a title as a football player. Um, you know, when you tell people about that side of your life, what's the reaction you get? And I'm sure you get all kinds of reactions about it. <laughs> yeah. And then when you come out here and share that knowledge, what, what's it like? Um, I think actually a lot of the guys out here have actually already heard of it, so it's not it's not a big surprise about it, you know, that we play. And um, I think women's football has grown tremendously, and it's still growing. It has a lot a lot to to go, a lot of ways to go. But I think um, you know my team, the New York Sharks, we've been around now for 20 seasons. Although it's my first season there, but they've been around for 20 years, so it's not something new. You know, it's been going on for a while, and it makes me better at both things. I feel you know being out here at Johnson and Wells, and also being a player. You have played pretty much every specialty position you, you were a quarterback a receiver a defensive back what have you learned from each and and you know applying it out here now uh, the co transitioning from the player to the coach what's mm -hmm. that switch like for you you know as I said you just have to you know build everything take knowledge of everything you know I kind of like limitless that movie you know you can kind of draw from so many different areas when you need it and although I've kind of specialized in receivers coaching you know I've been a defensive coordinator at a middle school you know I coach DBs I coach quarterbacks so uh, I think it, it's helped me a lot playing different positions to coach different positions because it you know I've, I've been there where they are and you know I have a lot of knowledge I feel like I can share ultimately you know perfect world I would love to be an offensive coordinator right now my short term is to ultimately get my foot in the door and be a receivers coach. What's it like for you to balance all this? Because you're you're coaching and over there winning championships and playing and now doing this as well. What's that like? Yeah, I mean, well, I don't have a pet or any kids or anything. So, <laughs> you know, it's, it's my life. It's what I do. Um, sometimes here, obviously, I split days. I'll be here for a while and then I'll run back to my office. And so I have really long days. You know, usually my day starts at around 7 and might end around midnight, you know, but um, it's all worth it to get this opportunity to be here. You don't like to draw a ton of attention to yourself just hearing, you know, your accolades are, your list of accolades is so long, but I know you don't kind of like to be a little bit more private about that yeah. and everything, but just the representation, being present out here and, and taking up space out here, what does that mean for another little girl who's walking by and looking through the hole in the fence? I mean, I think, you know, also this comes a lot with playing football, but just to know that, you know, you can do anything. You know, it's so special to see someone in a position that you never thought you could be in. You know, I, I was kind of like the Black Panther. You know, it was never like a black superhero, and I was a black superhero. I was like, holy cow. You know, it's really cool to see. And I I think for, for the little girls, and that's just what I want for them, just to let them know if this is what they want to do, they can do it. You know, it's not, you know, I started coaching basketball because that's what I felt I had to do. You know, I had to coach basketball because women didn't coach football, even though I would have loved to. But now, you know, we're getting an opportunity to do that. And maybe a little girl can, can forego doing something else and go straight into what she would really want to do.